The city of Murfreesboro has recently launched five new divisions, each under their own director. Urban Environmental recently merged into the street department. With a combination of the two, you know, it's, it's worked out really great. And now we're getting ready to go into our salt season. So uh, one thing that we struggle with here is we've never had enough people to work the 24-hour shifts that we have here at the street department. So uh, we currently have two crews now that we divided up into 12-hour shifts, and now we're able to run all of our salt trucks. And uh, so it's going to make it a lot easier on, on the individual employee. We feel like that um, citizens are going to see a huge benefit out of this as well. I think there was uh, 15 of those guys that came over here to work with us. And you know what? And morale's been good. You know, these guys, they're top-notch. Our guys are top-notch. And, you know, when you get that kind of quality of people working together, it's just been a great transition, uh, you know, and we're looking forward to the future. It currently is in peak time of the fall leaf collection. During this time of year, the street department helps the solid waste department pick up leaves due to the sheer volume. And the city is divided up to increase the speed. We're still, still working with that program, and it's been, that has worked very good because obviously we can get around, get around a lot faster. We have a different type of equipment versus what solid waste has. You know, they use the knuckle booms, which knuckle booms work fine. They're just a little slower than the back trucks that we use. So the idea was we were going to take the, the, the older part of town where the more mature trees are, where the bigger leaf piles are per se, and because uh, we could get those up a lot faster than they could. So it's worked out really great. So. Um, game plan still the same with it. It's working great. So, you know, that old saying, if it's not broke, don't fix it kind of deal. So. Two years ago, the street department purchased a brine making system that has increased their ability to battle Mother Nature when it comes to winter weather on city streets. The thing with, with brine is it doesn't cost very much at all. You know, you can take a bucket of salt and you can make you can make 10,000 gallons of brine with it. I mean, so, you know, and, and, and salt sold in a tonnage is less than 100 bucks, you know. So if you can get the brine down, it makes the snow removal process a lot easier. Of course, you know, brine's a mixture of water and salt. So if you, if you get this down and it's in place, and if it snows on top of it, it keeps it from sticking to the road. And if you get a lot of snow, it just makes, if we have to come through and plow over top of that, it just makes it kind of peel off the road a lot simpler. If you have leaves and yard waste that you've put on the street for pickup, Raymond welcomes citizens to give them a call. You're more welcome to call here anytime. Uh, you can just call the street department number there. If they can't call and schedule us to come get them and say, hey, my leaves are out, can you come pick them up? But we'll let you know where we're at and how long it'll be before we get there. Because we do have a route that we like to keep the guys on and so that, so that they don't get off track uh, and everybody's treated fairly that way.